If you need some coins to add some ballers to your team, make sure you go ahead and check out MudReserve.com. Fast service, great rates, no need to rely on pack luck. Get yourself some coins, buy the players you want, use code SPREE at checkout for 15% off. What's going on everybody? Hope you're all having another fantastic day today. You can call me Spree and welcome back to another video. Earlier today, the new legends drop. We've got Tony G, we have John Lynch, we have some new beasts added to the game. I want to go ahead and open up some packs. Don't let being no money spent stop you from opening up coin packs. It's always fun to get amongst, try your luck, see if you can get something glitchy. I've seen a lot of people pulling these LTDs from legend packs. Let's see if we can do the same from all pro fantasy packs. Before we get into it, a few do enjoy the content and definitely consider popping down hitting that subscribe button down below if you like the video hit that like button but let's get into it let's go see how many glitchy cards we can pull today jumping first onto the auction house as you can see tony g right there that card art that card out is something else look at it looking beautiful 640,000 coins his stats 84 speed good route running solid run blocking this card is probably now the best tight end in the game move over Jermichael Finley and then the second LTD we have is this man John Lynch now we have a lot of really good safeties in the game some good budget options some very good high overall ones as well going for around 620,000 coins solid speed good hit power good zone just an all-round good player six foot two as well we like having height in our secondary. Weirdly enough, the boss versions of both of these cards are around the same price. It's interesting, I didn't know how people would react to these LTD cards. They are the same as the power-up version, so I don't know. I don't know, I think it's fun being able to pull LCDs. That is why we're getting amongst it. I've never pulled an LTD card across any Madden, so hopefully, hopefully today's the day. Last year we got lucky, we got a few golden tickets, but I'm not gonna really count those. They were in packs the whole time. They were hard to get, but they weren't LTD like these cards. As you can see, we have 10 all pro fantasy packs. These have been the best packs that I've opened all year long. I pretty much made profit every single time I've opened them up. So we're gonna dive into the pack, see if we can pull something glitchy. My highest overall pull this year is still only an 85. So an 86 and 87, a glitchy 91 LTD. I will take whatever I can. Let's see if we can pull some heat today. Jumping on into this first pack, can we start off with a banger right here we got a gold and another and another nice very 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 nice uh we'll go with those two jumping on into the second round i've seen plenty of golds coming out of this round as well so obviously we have to take all of those not a bad first pack i love the fact that you can get a good amount of value from these cards back it looks like a trash pack but probably around 15,000, maybe 20,000 coins value from that pack. I'll take that. I'll take that. Moving on to pack number two. I am absolutely hyped to finally have football back. We get legends. We get 85 Bobby Bell. That is a really solid pull. I'll happily take that. Anything else? We get an elite as well, baby. An 80 overall and another elite. These packs are hot. An 84 and an 85. Anything in the secret one and another elite. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Your boy is hyped. Even though these cards are lower overall elites, for me, these are great pulls. I'm going to be able to make my coins back, hopefully. Keep rolling with these pack openings. On to this next one. Let's keep it rolling. Another elite. Let's go, Lane Johnson. Superstar? A 78. All right. All right. Anything else in this? We got a chase. We got a chase. Chase used to be expensive. We'll go with chase. Anything else in this one? I'm liking these packs, baby. I'm liking these packs. Currently, oh, we got another one, an 80 overall. Let's go, another one. Elite flying out of these packs, another one. That's triple elite again. Again, we'll take the newly paid Elvin Kamara. See if we can get anything in this round. A power up, a Darren Waller. I don't know, but I'm pretty sure that has some good value still. Anything else in this pack? Wow, wow, these packs, these packs are hot. It still feels like a little bit surreal that football is back amongst everything, but I'm hyped for it. We get coins, we get platinum, we'll take Deshaun Watson. Let's go, we are pulling heat right now. We are making a decent amount of coins. I'm confident so far, we are well ahead. We're making a bunch of profit. Even if we go trash, even if we go cold for the rest of the pack opening, I think. I think we're pretty much there for making our coins back. Jumping on into this next one, we're probably due for a very average pack. I'm expecting all gold probably, 
Is it, is it an 81? Still a clutch finish. Still got to get ourselves an elite in this final round. Bunch of silvers. Yeah, about what we'd expect, really. Down in the comment section below, I want you to let me know who your favorite team is and how you think they're going to do this season. Who's their first week matchup? How do you think they're going to go in that particular game? I think my boys, the Broncos, are going to play pretty well. The Titans are a good team. I'm expecting it to be a battle. I wouldn't be surprised if we go down, but it's just so damn good to have football back. I'm excited to be able to just sit there, watch a bunch of red zone. I'm hyped, boys. I'm hyped. The last couple packs have cooled off a little bit, not pulling the elites we were earlier. So is that... Ooh. Oh, we might be in a bit of a cold streak, boys. Can we get anything to keep us rolling? A lot of golds. A lot of golds. I'll take all the golds. Second to last pack. Can we get a little bit of heat in this one? No LTA. A. Yeah, that's not what I want to see. Guess we'll go with the two highest overall ones right there. Anything else? No. No, no, no. Not how we want to finish, boys. One final pack one final pack to pull an lcd to come up clutch let's see if we can do it let's see if we can be great i definitely think we've made a bunch of coins back from this pack opening so i'm not going to complain about that we get a jerry judy we get an elite we get an 83 right there we get a gold hit it from the back hit it from the another elite baby an 82 and an 83 what a good way to finish what do we get there 74 and a bunch of really average cards. It cost us 300,000 coins flat to buy those 10 All Pro Fantasy Packs. And I'm pretty sure we made some profit, boys. 85, 84, and this 84 together cost around 100, 110,000 coins. We have this quick sell. We will take those 38,000 coins right there. Just those four cards were pretty much halfway there to getting our coins back. We also have one, two, three, four, five, six more elites that we can sell that's probably going to get us close to another 100k maybe 80 to 100k and i'm sure we have 50k in golds here so i think i think we're probably in the region of maybe 50 to 80 000 coins profit that's perfect we're going to be able to keep these pack openings rolling i love these all pro fantasy packs i think while cards are still decent value they're going to be a good chance to pull something obviously no ltd but i'll take a big chunk of change i'll take all the profit that we just got and i think that's going to be about it for today folks let me know down in the comment section below if you opened up some packs and how you went today hopefully you guys pulled something absolutely crazy if you haven't already go ahead hit that like button hit that subscribe button it definitely helps me out the youtube algorithm all that magic it helps me out so thank you very much for supporting your boy but yeah that is going to be it for today folks thank you very much for coming through take it easy everyone you can call me spree and we out